Welcome to the HyperSecQ YouTube channel. So, you want to change your user PIN for your Hyper PKI token. Well, you've come to the right place. It's a very easy procedure. So first, you have your token, obviously, your Hyper PKI EPAS 2003. And on that token, you have your certificate that was probably set up by the tech department. And now you're encrypting and decrypting emails and all is going well. But to change your PIN, which may be a default PIN they've given you, and they've just sent an email for everybody to change their PIN, you are not sure how to do this. So what we do is we go to the ePass 2003 Token Manager. If you do not see this Token Manager here, you'll click on All Programs, go to Enter Safe, Enter Safe ePass 2003, ePass through 2003 Token Manager. So what I'll have to do here is I'll select my token. This may be under your name or company name, and I'll have to log in. So when I log in, a box appears to enter my user PIN. So I enter my user PIN and log into the token. And now I'm able to view my certificate and perform a few key actions. For example, change user PIN. Here, when I click change user pin, a box appears and it says to insert your old user pin, new user pin, and confirm. So I will do that now. And now I'm entering the confirm. And the changing user pin succeeded. So I've successfully changed my user pin. As I mentioned, you may want to do this occasionally for security purposes. And if you have a default pin, I would highly suggest changing this to your own user pin. As always, if you have any questions, please feel free to contact us anytime. You can contact our headquarters or contact me directly. Thank you for your time. And if you have any questions, feel free to write me an email.